Simons have been pretty crazy. From Naples to Marseille. And even today, it's time to turn it up a notch. We grew from 18 to 25,000 subscribers in just a month. And we are far from done yet. So please subscribe and like this video. Because this is only the beginning. The fan scene in Belgium is in my opinion heavily underrated. The last edition was to say the least a wild one. Crazy Pyro, Typho and overall Ultras will go for 90 minutes with full passion. I want to experience that. And of of course, I want to take you guys with me along the way. However, after a few tumultuous trips, I went home for a week to reset and recuperate. Have said things at peace. And what looks from the outside as the best thing possible might not always go down that way. I missed out on some huge opportunities through just bad luck. And how hard I tried to fulfill to some of the comments and messages I received. Over the last few weeks mentally, the pieces never seemed to fit. Well, that one is gone now. I think sometimes it can be really easy to let setbacks like this hold us back. However, today I've chosen to let moments like this be a test, testing my commitment to the purpose behind the stories that I've chosen to create. Deep down, I felt good about my intentions and clear about what I wanted to tell. So after a long brain session, and when you all decided to keep ground hopping, I said to myself, so we did. Guys, I just arrived in Brussels on the left. It's all very last minute because I was stuck in an airplane for four and a half hours. But I gotta keep positive with your insane support. So let's just enjoy this class. Andere fans voor de Glasgow Kent Standaar. What do you think of Standaar Liège? What are they for you? I think they are um, assholes. Okay. Okay. Fuck your mouth today. Okay. 5-0. Uh, 5-0. Yes. <laughs> okay, you're confident. <laughs> what do people do when they watch this video? Abonneer. <laughs> yes. Yes. <laughs>
Still checking it. Now, it hasn't been all smooth the last month or so. Honestly, I've been extremely stressed at some points. Ultimately, I'm still getting the groove of this new lifestyle. However, the last few months have also been a blast so far. With all the new experiences and the moments of meeting lots of people from this community. All of this has been motivating to work hard to keep telling these stories. Even today showed me that I had no idea what I would get myself into. Which shows me that sometimes in life we only gotta follow a direction and a mindset to make the most of every moment. I think life is full of uncertainties, but maybe that's just the way it's supposed to be. 